Hi, I'm Steve with The Music Store, and today I want to talk about the different qualities of instruments and what that might be able to do for various players. So Rachel, is there a difference between better quality instruments? Like, you, you recently got one yourself, we uh, went through and we got, a couple years ago, got a better quality instrument. What were some of the differences that you found in your playing when you upgraded that instrument? Well, the differences are just amazing. I noticed immediately when I got my new instrument that technical elements that I was struggling with immediately got better with zero extra hours of practice, which is wonderful. But the main difference I noticed is the projection. When you get a better instrument, the wood is better, the craftsmanship is better. So basically you have a bigger, better speaker. So it's going to be louder, but in a good way. And it's so much easier to play. I noticed after orchestra rehearsals, I was so much less tired because I didn't have to try as hard mm. to execute all of the technical elements. So if you're really looking to go to the next level, you might think you're the problem, but maybe it's also your instrument and you will achieve great success by moving up to a better quality instrument. Now let me ask you a question about projection. When you say projection, do you mean how loud it is or how far that sound travels? So I'm really talking about how far the sound goes. So if I'm playing on a stage, I want my sound to carry to the back of the hall. And sometimes you'll get a poor quality instrument that's really bright and kind of zings to the back of the hall, but it's not a very nice sound. It's kind of a harsh sound like someone's screaming at you. But you get a beautiful instrument, even when you're playing quietly, you can still hear it at the back of the hall, but it's a very beautiful sound. All right, so what we want to do today is we want to show you three different qualities of instruments. So the first one we're going to start with is a DR-10, and this is one of the very first instruments that we find that we really like outside of the student quality instrument. So there's that beginning instrument, and then this really is the next step up. So I think this is really good for that high school player that's just wanting to play at the high school level, but maybe not competitively or really push themselves very much. Would you agree? Yeah, if you've got a high school player who's just only playing in orchestra and is um, not doing any solo work, but if you've got a good private teacher and you're working on solo repertoire, um, you probably would want to go well, above what that. this is. But this is definitely better if you're still on your first student full-size rental and it's just not the tone quality you need, this would be a good first step up. Why don't you play this one for us so we can hear it. So I hear a good sound quality, definitely more full than a normal beginner instrument, but um, really bright. It doesn't have a, an overly round, warm sound, but a much better sound than a, than a student quality. Would you agree? Absolutely. So it's very even and doesn't have a big sound. One thing, the biggest thing you can listen for as you go to better quality violins, they will have less of the nasally sound. Mm -hmm. They will have a much more full sound. And so this one is definitely not as nasally as a beginner instrument, but it's still not quite as full and round as a nicer instrument. All right. So the next instrument we're going to change out to is a core select. This is the 2350, um, a really good instrument. This, so we've gone from a, Chi a Chinese made instrument uh, from a remarkable uh, uh, builder. And if you want, I'll do a link in the show notes that talk about where that builder is and, and how, uh, how we found him. He's just a phenomenal guy. I had a relationship with him now since probably 2004. This guy is also Chinese made. But the difference, primary difference is wood quality. So we've gone into an aged Carpathian forest wood, so the wood itself is a little bit better. And I find that anytime we increase the quality of materials or the quality of craftsmanship, we get a better result. Absolutely. Play that one for us. I think it sounds better. Do you agree? So this has a different sound quality. It's much richer and has a little bit warmer quality. Maybe not as bright as the other one, but often that's a good thing. Yeah, so if we're doing solo ensemble contest, if you're trying out for like state orchestra, uh, all state orchestra, this is the instrument that's, the level of instrument that's going to start giving you a little bit more of a competitive advantage. Now the next level I want to look at is for that person who's going past that. I'm not just trying to get into state solo and ensemble. I'm wanting to win. Uh, I don't want to be just in state orchestra. I want to be sitting in the, in the first chairs and possibly on that first stand. 
Um, I'm looking to get into college and I want to be competitive in my college scholarship auditions. That's this next level of investment that I want to look at. We've gone to a CS5500 at this point. So slightly different builder, still distributed through the core, um, core name. Why don't you play this for us and tell us what we think. I really hope you can hear this in the recording. There's so much more sound in the room. Do you agree? Yeah, when you get to a better instrument, you're going to start to hear more overtones ringing. So overtones is when you get sympathetic vibrations and it fills out the sound. And so you actually get other strings and part of the instrument vibrating. And so that's why you're hearing, you should be hearing, maybe not on the video, but in live, you should be able to hear a warmer, richer sound. So I feel like when I play this versus the other ones, I get a better tone quality with less effort and I sound like I'm a better player just because I'm on a better instrument. So it really is wonderful to move up. So do you agree that you can buy yourself a better sound? You can absolutely buy yourself a better sound. I still gotta play in tune, but everything you've worked hard to do is just gonna bump up immediately. So you can absolutely buy yourself a better sound. Finding the right instrument for you can be a challenge. We know that families struggle to find a quality instrument at an affordable price. So that's why at the music store we have spent the last 20 years of our lives uh, going around meeting different builders and finding out who makes what for who in order to find quality instruments that you can do uh, that you can take home to your family and we do our best to finance those and make it as affordable as possible for you so you can get into those quality instruments um, so if you have any questions or want to try some of these things out by all means give us a shout uh, here at the music tour and we'll help you out